and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be showing you what has been on my favourites for the month of September. So keep watching if you want to see that. Also don't be afraid to hit that subscribe button down below this video or over on my YouTube channel and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. September favourites are a little bit of everything. I don't have a lot of beauty products this month just because there wasn't anything new that I had tried out. Um, but the first thing on my favourites list for the month of September is, is a backpack. And because I am totally obsessed with fantasy and Harry Potter, I couldn't resist but um, put this on my favourites list. But, so this is just a little black backpack from Primark. Um, with HP written on the front of it in gold and um, lettering and it's got a cute little Hedwig um, owl on the side on the zipper and he's so cute um, it doesn't fit an awful lot in it um, it's quite small um, which is for the essentials there is a little section that you can put your phone um, and a few things in there it's also got another little zip compartment at the bottom which is handy and um, if you want to put like your water bottle in it um, which would be handy because if you're like me it always spills no matter what you do so that is the first thing that I've been loving for this month so the second thing I've been really loving lately is to be a little bit more organised so I picked up an organiser so this one says let's have some fun on the front of it and it's actually a 17 month agenda um, and I picked that up in Easton's I think it was about 20 euro um, but I've really been loving that and it's got really nice um, it's got lovely little quotes on the inside as well and this one says you are the best and it just has each week and it just has like the days um, and can't forget which is really important because I do forget a lot um, and then just on the side here it says to do list so that's really handy as well so each day you can write down what to do and at the start of it, it has birthdays and stuff as well um, and a bigger to do list and to buy so I just thought this is really handy and I've been trying to be a little bit more proactive um, would be organised and everything so I just find this really handy so that's the second thing on my list so I'm going to move into beauty products next so I've only three beauty products that I've been loving but I wanted to share them with you so the first one is the illuminating powder by Bourjois which is this one here in a little and it's just in this little green uh, box so I love how this makes your skin look um, and feel and I love that it gives that lovely illuminating um, effect to the skin as well so that is the bourgeois illuminating powder so the last um, two beauty items are from MAC they're gold glitters and they just look like that and as you can see one is more holographic than the other and this one is more finer and um, milled uh, glitter than the other one but I have been having fun um, creating lots of different looks um, and I can't wait to um, use some of these over Halloween which I'm so excited about um, and if you guys want to see me do a certain look then don't forget to comment down below um, and I think these will be really really nice for over the Christmas um, kind of festive season as well so I can't wait to really um, go crazy with them again I've already tried them and that's why they're on my uh, favourites list for this month but um, I really am looking forward to creating some fun looks with this over Halloween. So the next thing is movies and I've been obsessed with uh, Star Wars at the moment and um, I love the, the whole saga is just fantastic um, and I've been binge watching these lately. Um, I have been loving The Last Jedi, Rogue One and The Force Awakens. They have been my guilty pleasure um, after work um, during the weekdays and even just to watch them over and over again. I love watching Star Wars and um, as I said I'm a massive fan um, but who doesn't love Star Wars? I mean just it's easy to watch as well and um, so I have been loving them. So the next thing I've been um, loving is a TV series and it's called The Discovery of Witches. And it is just after starting on Sky One and 
it's brilliant um it's already on to the second um, episode so I can't wait to see the next one because it looks really really good. I absolutely love fantasy as you guys know by now. Um, I, I do have a discovery of which is the first book um, that it's based on. Um, I have yet to read it so I don't know whether I should start reading it now or wait till the series is um, ended. What do you guys reckon? I mean should I read it? Should I not? comment down below and let me know. So it basically follows this young academic who uh, reconnects with her witch heritage and um, meeting a charming vampire <laughs> and yeah I'm actually hooked already and um, so it's brilliant and I would definitely recommend it um, but that is the TV show that I am now hooked on for this month. So the last thing on my favourites for the month of September is Spotify. Um, I recently joined it um, about a month or so ago and I have been really, really loving it. I just find it's great because you can um, listen to music on the go if you want to take it with you on holidays. It's, it's handy when you're travelling. Um, but also if you're going for a walk or anything you can just put your headphones in and carry it on your phone because you can download the app to your phone which is really handy and it's not that expensive uh, per month as well so that is the last thing I've been loving for the month of September so that's it you guys I hope you enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give me a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button till next time bye